The superintendent of Seattle Public Schools gave her board an update as to how this transition to remote learning is going. She admits there have been many challenges and expects this to be a long road. Today, we've learned that 12,000 remote learning packets have been handed out to students just this week. 5,000 meals a day have been passed out across the city at 26 meal sites. Getting students online is another challenge in itself. Currently, high school seniors are the priority as the district will work on rolling out devices starting as early as Wednesday. There just going to have to be some patience as we roll out, but people have to know that there is a plan, um, that we are going to have uh, one to one devices at those levels, and then hopefully uh, Amazon can fill some of the gaps that we may have at the elementary level. And so once we get those all distributed, as I said, we will be building a very robust program and I know our teachers and staff are up for that challenge. This move to remote learning will have an impact on next year's lessons as well and could even change this summer for some students. The superintendent says she's looking at creating a robust summer learning plan in an effort to make sure no students fall behind. And keep in mind, next week, Seattle Public School students head into spring break. Good news there. The superintendent telling them it'll still go on as planned. She hopes they come back relaxed and ready to learn for what will be week three of remote learning. In Seattle, Sebastian Robertson, King 5 News.